What up, Blockchain Nation? What up, YouTube? Welcome to All Things Blockchain. Thank you for taking the time to subscribe to this channel. If you haven't subscribed, please hit the subscribe button below so that you can get weekly notifications whenever I release videos. Uh, awesome. So today, I want to talk about something. How and why I started this YouTube channel. So, like everybody else, or like a lot of us, or a lot of you out there, You've been wondered for the longest time or you've considered starting a YouTube channel and you have procrastinated, you've thought about it, you have some great ideas and then you get stuck in analysis paralysis. You wonder how do you do it, how you have the time, what kind of content would you put out. But even though you have that nagging feeling that keeps on coming on to you in your heart and you have this impression to go ahead and start a YouTube channel and you just for whatever reason procrastinate. Today I'm going to tell you how I got started. So, years ago, I actually thought about starting a channel just like you have. And I just uh, never did. Then a couple of years later, well, as you know, I got involved with blockchain technology and uh, found out about Bitcoin, blah de blah. And I was looking for resources on YouTube on blockchain technology and then there were not so many although they still are and there's some great ones out there but I was looking predominantly for information on blockchain certifications how to become a certified blockchain developer and at that, at that time there was little or not much stuff out there I was writing the uh, certified Bitcoin professional exam and I just found only one resource and I an idea came to me I thought hmm wouldn't it be great to actually start or do a YouTube video on passing this blockchain or certification exam or on all the certifications out there. And I uh, thought about it and I didn't do it. Five months later, I'm on YouTube and I um, start to think about doing that again, but I figured out, let me just go out and check what's out there and see if anyone has done any certifications on or any YouTube videos on blockchain certifications and I found out that a couple of people had and had a thought wow five months ago these guys hadn't done these videos and now they have what would have happened if I actually done the video and probably you thinking the same thing you probably had an idea or something to do on YouTube decided not to do it and now months later somebody has done the exact what you were thinking about doing and has discouraged you from going out going on YouTube but I don't think you should stop I don't think that should stop you because in the end I decided to, and I thought to myself what the heck I did my video on certifications I put a link below which was one of the as you can see in my opinion worst videos I've done <laughs> took me 10 years 10 hours just to put that together and um, as you can see it's not one of my best but I, my point is I did it anyway and now we are here a couple of videos after and I never stopped doing a video since then. So that's just the thing, you just have to start. I know you're afraid, I know you're worried about people trolling you and saying that your stuff is not good, but just go ahead and start. What do you have to lose? And you might think, well, somebody else is doing what I'm trying to do. Maybe somebody else has had the idea of, maybe you're trying to start something in cooking. Maybe you're trying to start a video about technology. Maybe you're starting, trying to start a video about, I don't know what it is. And you figure that there are there's so many out videos out there. Well, I think you should still do it anyway. First of all, the first reason is because you are unique and you are going to put your own unique twist to whatever it is that you're doing. So, it doesn't matter who else is doing it or who else has done something similar, you need to do it as well. That's the first reason. Second thing is, most people quit. Most people start stuff and they never follow through. You have to decide that you're just going to do a video, at least one video. If you can do a video a month, that's fine. If you can do a video a week, that's even better. If you're worried about what you're going to do, well, just start. Start and I promise you, you'll figure it out along the way. All right? Success is not for the chosen few. In my opinion, it's for the few people that choose. So, how I started, I just got a camera and I started recording. I was nervous. I was anxious. I worried about how it would look like, but I just did it anyway. 
and that's what you need to do too. You need to just, if you're thinking about being a content creator, my personal opinion is that you should just go ahead and start, All right? There's nothing to fear but fear itself. Most people don't achieve or don't go after their goals and dreams anyway, but that shouldn't be you. So, till next time, my wish for you is that you actually go out and start your own YouTube channel because you're a content creator and you have so much to say. And if you're willing to take the plunge, pick up a camera and start. All right, till next time, let's go change the world.